Hi everybody, welcome back to the channel. I'm actually going to do a flip through of the new Mythagoria Night Terrors, a darkly beautiful horror colouring book. Um, this is a new series that's come out um, and this one is by Fabiana Atanasio, so completely different. So there's the front and the back. Dark dreams come to life in spectacular art and nightmarish splendour. As you know, I'm a huge fan of the Alan Robert book, so I thought I'll have a look at this and see what it's like. Let me pull that back slightly. So there's your, your title page. Now, what I do like about this is it is single-sided, so you can get in and use your markers. And they're perforated as well if you wanted to frame them. So, this is a completely different style of stuff from Fabiana. We're used to her lovely uh, fairy tale ones. I like this one. So you can use your markers in here or your pencils. Nice, thin but nice paper. I like that one. If you can hear building work going on, it's it's um, next door's house being renovated after their fire last year. Um, they're due to move back in the 17th of next month, so hope fingers crossed. And then we'll have noise coming from ours when we get our bathroom and kitchen done, but there you go. That's what it is. So, yeah, these are quite scary. I'm hoping to do one next month for Halloween. Month. Um, it's your Plague Doctor. I mean, look at that. It's just really gory. So I, I would be uh, wary of this one. I like that one. That's the cl uh, looks like a killer clown. It's quite, quite horrible. Oh, let's have a look. Here we go, it's the next one. This one. I like these, I gotta be honest. It's a really, really good book. God see it, and I was like, oh. There is another mythical way out, and I'll, I might try and order that at the beginning of the month when I get paid. I'm trying to cut down on my spending. I've still got a few books this month, but uh, this is obviously one of them. So uh, not a huge amount. I've got a. There won't be a haul this month. Be next month. I love anything to do with death, like this, because I always do it like Terry Pratchett's death. So, with um, sapphire blue eyes, it always reminds me of Terry Pratchett. Death is the most human of his characters. There's another one. That's good. Wow. Oh, absolutely fantastic. You have to excuse my voice, I do have a sore throat and a bit of a cold and a cough. Um, so I'm a bit croaky, but I wanted to, to get these done. I'm fed up and missing filming because I, I was ill all last week, didn't do any filming. Uh, and uh, I'm fed up with that, I'm going to have to work through it because um, I don't want to let you guys down. You, you stick with me, I, I love you. Yeah, these are a little bit on the odder side. There's some weird stuff going on in these. But still, I like the book. I think the pictures are interesting. And I do like some fairly gory stuff. I just do. That's just the way I am. I'm, I'm, I'm quite a gory person. <laughs> I grew up watching the horror movies of the 80s, so... You know, when I was at 14, 15, I was watching 18 rated movies. So, like Evil Dead and Nightmare on Elm Street and all that stuff. Uh, and they didn't bother me. So. It's a good one. On this tree with eyes and some skulls in it. I like that one as well. I, I do, I think these are great. So it's not a very thick book, I'll, I'll give you that. It's not as thick as the mythographic ones, but it's still really good. No, I am enjoying this one. Finding the page is hard to turn, but I think that's just me. And that's a really good one in in the uh, graveyard or the cemetery. I like ones like that. And this one, the scary uh, scarecrow. Ow! 
Oh yeah, that's that. Yeah, that's good. See, I love these. I think they, these are fantastic. I, I will try and colour at least one next month. I don't know which one yet, but I'm going to try and colour one of them um, soon. So yeah, that's it. This is a brand new book from uh, Fabia Ana Atenasio. Yeah, there you go. So, um, yeah, I'll leave a link to this book down below so you can go buy it if you want. Uh, if you want me to colour in it, just leave me a link, uh, leave me a comment down below in the comment section and I will add it to my list. Next year I'm going to keep a colouring journal so I can keep a list of everything like that as I just forget and I'm hopeless unless I write it down. So, anyway, I'll see you in the next one. Bye everyone!